Hi guys, storm 2 one back again with another Nanoblock Unbuild and Rebuild. And in this video we're going to be working on Lapras, the Water Bus Pokemon from Generation 1. And appropriately, Water Bus uh, suits it to a T because it transports uh, other humans and Pokemon on the back, on its back, to uh, traverse the watery uh, depths of, well, the oceans of the Pokemon world. So in this video I'm going to show you guys all the techniques and methods that I use when building uh, to build the model, uh, so let me show you what I have got. So I have uh, um, built my uh, Lapras model for my collection. I'll try and show you guys. Uh, leave a link in the uh, description for my uh, original Nanobot collection. But we have got some uh, blues here. We got some two by twos, some threes here. We got some t uh, little one by ones, uh, one by ones, two and some threes here. We got some uh, light blue L's. We've also got some. Um, Cream uh, or orangey, uh, they kind of look uh, well, light brownish uh, in my opinion. But uh, uh, we've got uh, them in all, keep, uh, all shapes and sizes in one, uh, two by threes, and one by threes, and one by twos. And we've also got some uh, dark, well, sort of grayish uh, two by threes, uh, tees, and one by ones. We've even got some white uh, two by ones and black one by twos here. So this is a uh, very interesting uh, build because you get to do this in two separate uh, parts. You can do the head of the model and the body. So for the start of this build, I'm going to gather all the pieces uh, that you need for step one of the head build. Okay, so for step one of the build, uh, I forgot to mention that uh, there is no right or wrong way of uh, building this model. You can start off out with the body if you want, but for the purpose of this video, I'm starting off with the head. So for the pieces, uh, I've got two 1x3s here, four 2x3s, a... oh dear, hang on. Sorry guys, so minor technical uh, glitch with the camera, but it's all fixed now, as you can see. Uh, so, uh, starting off where, where I began, uh, two 1x3s, Four two by threes, a two by two, a one by two in blue. Uh, we've also got a uh, light brownish uh, two by three right over there, and we have two white one by twos and black one by twos to uh, start forming the pupils of the eyes. So it, uh, so we are going to uh, work on uh, the face of Lapras uh, whilst we do the build. So I'm going to show you guys in a second uh, how I approach this method. Okay, so step one of the head build is now completed. Uh, so let me show you what I did uh, at the base of the head. First of all, I did a 1x3 right here, followed by a blue, uh, well, in light blue. Then a 2x3, also in light blue. Then a light brown 2x3, and a light blue 2x3 again. Then for the top, I did a light blue 2x3 here. I put it on top of the uh, 1x3 first, so that we got a good solid foundation uh, for, the, uh, for the rest of the uh, step. Then uh, I put on a light blue 1x2 right here in the middle. Then here at the front was the black 1x2s right here and here. Then a white 1x2 uh, here and here, followed by the blue 2x3 here and the 2x2 here, with the last 1x3 at the back of the head. So that step is now completed, and we're going to move on to uh, the next step, for which is step 2 of the head. So I just need to gather the pieces to show you what you need. Okay, so we're going to be finishing off uh, Lapras' eyes in step 2. Uh, the pieces that you will need for the build are four 2x3s in light blue, two 1x3s, three 2x2s, two L's, and two 1x2s here. And we are also going to need the last two white 2x2s and black 2x2s for this step. So it won't take that long, I'll show you guys uh, the end result in just a second. The second step of the head build is now completed. Uh, what I did first was the blue, light blue 2x3 here at the front, then I worked up to the uh, black 1x2s here and here, and then again with the white 1x2s here and here. There's no gap in the middle between those uh, pieces, so there's no need to, uh, to uh, fill up that, uh, the gap in between the, the uh, 1x2s. Then behind each of the uh, white 1x2s is a blue 2x2 here and here, followed by a Two, a blue 2x3 right here at the back, so that the uh, back of the head has a, a bit of versatility. Then here at the top, as you can see, I've done a light blue 1x3, followed by a 2x3 here, then here, then on both sides here, uh, over the uh, black 1x2s and white 1x2s, is a light blue 1x2. Then behind each one is an L where the uh, gaps are facing towards uh, the back of the heads, one heading nor uh, northeast and northwest. That's a good way uh, to tell uh, when the brick is, uh, which way a brick is going. Uh, 
Then a uh, light blue 2x3 here, and then one 2x2 two two right here. So the uh, head is now complete. I'm now going to get the pieces I will need for step 3 of the build as we're going to finish, as we're going to uh, make up some more progress towards the top of that person's head. Okay, so the pieces that you need for step 3 of the head build are as follows. You need three 2x3s two here, three 1x2s, three 1x3s, two 2x2s, two two and a 1x1. One one. Just be careful uh, that you don't lose any of the 1x1 uh, one one pieces because they are very small. They're about 4mm by 4mm by 5mm. They're actually so small that they can actually fit at the top of your index finger like so. So just be careful when sorting out your bricks uh, beforehand, okay? And uh, I'm going to show you guys the uh, end result of uh, step 3 for the head in a sec. Okay, so step 3 of the head build is now complete. Let me show you guys uh, what I've done. Uh, at the top here, I've put on a light blue 2x3. Then behind it is a 1x2 here and here. And behind each one of these on the side where Lapras's ears start to form, or part of her head uh, is a 2x2 uh, two two here and here then right here at the back is a light blue 2x3 followed by a light blue 1x2 uh, sorry 1x3 and 1x2 sorry then at the top I've used the, the little 1x1 one one on its own here as a perfect uh, foundation brick so that you uh, so that it's easy so that you don't uh, lose, your, lose, your, lose your way when building the head then from, ba uh, from going front to backwards is a light blue 1x3 here Followed by a 2x3 here and here, then another 1x3 right here. So we're nearly done with the head of Lapras, all I need now are the pieces to finish off the top of the head. Okay, so the final pieces for step 4 of the head build are a light blue 1x3 here, a 2x3, two 2x2s, two, two, two 1x1s, and two Ls. And that's it, all we're doing is the top of Lapras's head and the ears. So after that, the head will be completed. Let me show you guys the end result momentarily. And step four of the head build is now completed. Uh, so first of all, I did the well a light blue one by one right here at the front of the head. Then behind it was a blue was the blue two by three. Then a blue one by three here behind the two by three. Then underneath the uh, right here, as you can see on both sides, is a light blue L here. And again here. And for the final pieces at the top is a one by three right here, followed by two two by twos here and here. So we are now done with the head build of the model, we're now going to get started on the body build of the model. If you haven't done the, the body build yet, it, uh, it's not a problem, you can uh, start out wherever you want to. But uh, like I said, uh, for the purpose of this video, I'm starting off with the head, head and now I'm going to work on the body. Okay, so we are going to uh, get started on step one of the body build. Now, if you've started this instead of the head, that is not a problem. You can do it. You can do this model in whatever method you want to do. If you've started off with the head, it's completely fine. There's uh, no right or wrong with doing this. Uh, the, the instructions have said uh, to uh, do this both separately, but if you can uh, do it um, like uh, head separately or head first or body first. Then it is, and then it is completely up to you. So, uh, first of all, the pieces for the step we have at least seven blue, light blue two by threes, and a light blue one by three right here. Five two by twos here, and two L's. Next up are the uh, light brown two by threes here, with two uh, one by twos here, and finally three one by threes. Then finally for the light rays, which will be the uh, back, the actual back of uh, the Lapras model, are. Uh, three two by threes here, two T's and two one by ones. Now I'm gonna get started on this build. This might take me uh, quite well to do, but uh, as long as I uh, keep an eye on uh, the instructions on how to build it, I should be okay. Okay, so step one of the body build is now completed. Uh, it was a little tricky at first, but uh, as long if you uh, recognize the uh, methods that I use in your builds, you should be able to get through this. So uh, what I did first was the uh, bottom layer of step one. I did the light brown two, one by three here, then here, and the light brown one by two. Then behind each one of those uh, one by threes and one by twos is a light blue two by three here and here. Now make sure that there's a nice little gap right here in the middle, so that uh, it gets some nice distance, so that uh, the back of the build is done. Then a light blue two by three here and here, where my fingers are pointing. Then from here. 
here is the light blue one, a 2x2 two two here and here, followed by a 2x3 here and a 2x2 two two here. Then at the back is a 2x3 here and a 2x3 here, followed by a light blue 1x3 so that we got a bit of Lapis's tail down. Now on the uh, top side of it is a light brown 1x2 right here at the front. Then uh, that, that was uh, my foundation brick for when I did the uh, next layer of the, the step. It's always good to have a good uh, light, uh, foundation brick uh, so that you know where you can build around and uh, how to do it. Then on both sides of that 1x2 is a 2x3 here and here in light brown. Then right next to each one is a light blue 2x2 two two here and here, followed by an L right between uh, the uh, t the uh, light brown and the light blue. And make sure that uh, the light blue here is facing northwest and here is northeast. Then behind each one is a dark, well, kind of a uh, grayish uh, T right here and here. Then behind each one is a 2x3 here and here, then a 2x3 right here, then right uh, beside, uh, right here and here, for that uh, final part of the 2x3, uh, is a light grey 1x1 one one here and here. Yeah, oh, sorry, where my fingernail is, and uh, that's it for that step. So, it might feel a little unsteady, but don't worry about that, because in the uh, next step, we're going to uh, try, uh, we're going to stabilize the model a little more with uh, step two and building up more on Lapis's back. Okay, so for step two of the body build, we are, we are in need of three two by threes right here in like, in the grayish, dark grayish, uh, four two by twos, a T and six one by ones. Then for the light blues, we need two one uh, two by twos, a one by three, and two one by twos right here. Then finally, we need a light brown two by three here, three one by threes, and three one by twos. So those pieces are going to be uh, helping out with more of the belly of Lapras, but also for the back where it uh, transports uh, anybody that's got. So uh, this is going to be. Should be good, I'll uh, carry on uh, with the build and show you guys the end result momentarily. The second step of the build is now completed. Uh, so first of all, I did a light, the light brown 2x3 right here at the front. Then on both sides, a 1x2. So that's a good solid foundation for of, uh, the for the layer. Then behind the, uh, also uh, behind the 2x3 uh, is a 1x3 light brown. Then I had to do a light blue 2x2 here and again here. Then on the back is a grey uh, 1 by uh, 2 by 3, uh, sorry, 1 by 1. Uh, and this is exactly the same uh, depending on uh, where you are. So it's a little 1 by 1 by uh, where my uh, index finger is. And this is on uh, both sides of the uh, back. So uh, there's also a grey 1 by uh, 2 by 3 here and here. And the same again, another grey 1 by 1 here and here. Followed by a grey, oh sorry, a uh, grey 1x1 one one here and here. Followed by a grey 2x3 here at the back. Now for the top, uh, and of course uh, there is also a light blue 1x3 one layer. 1x3 uh, is to help out uh, with the foundation for the next layer, which I'm going to explain. So it's a uh, light brown 1x3 here and here. And again a 1x2 right here at the back. Then we're sticking with the 1x2s, we're going light blue right here and here. Followed by a grey, well, greyish 1x1 one one here and here. Followed by a 2x2 uh, two two here and here. And again here and here. Followed by a grey T right there at the back. So uh, we have come uh, quite a way. We're nearly done with the uh, top side of the body. We just have uh, one more step to go and I'll show you what you have to do. So the pieces for step 3 of the body build are as follows. We need the T, uh, the grey T's here. A 1x1. One two two by twos and five one uh, two by threes right here then for the light blues we need a one by three and a two by three and finally for the light brown it is a one by three right uh, two one by threes right here so we are nearly done with the uh, top side of the body let me show you guys the end result in a minute Okay, so step three of the Lapras build, uh, body build is now complete. Uh, first of all, I did a light brown 1x3 here at the front, followed by a light blue 2x3 right here at the back. Then by, uh, behind the 2x3 is a light grey T here and here. You know where my uh, index finger is pointing to? Then behind each one is a 2x2 two two here and here, followed by a 2x3 right here at the end. Then next layer up, 
right here is a uh, light brown 1x3 with a light brown, a light blue 2x3 right here. Now don't worry about the gap right here, we're going to address that in a minute. In fact, it's where the uh, head for Lapras is going to be. I'm going to show uh, you guys how you can put it on in a minute. I'm just going to finish off explaining what I've done. First of all, I did a uh, 2 by 3 right here, and then again here, followed by one more here at the back. Then on the top here is another 2 by 3 followed by a little 1 by 1 So that is it for step 3 of the build. I'm going to show you guys what you have to do for step 4 of uh, live on camera, because there's some... I haven't really done much of this uh, on the camera for... Or this whole video, so it would be nice for me to show you guys what you have to do. So you turn the model upside down, and the pieces that you need for this step are as follows. You need two L's, two light blue 1x3s, two 2x2s, two and three light brown 2x3s right there. So, first of all, in regards to the uh, light browns, here we go. You start off by like so, so you build up the um, underside of the model like so. And that's that. Then for the 2x2s here, you have to put them uh, at the back. So they kind of act like um, the, flip, the rear flippers of uh, Lapras. Now, for the front flippers, what you have to do is you grab a 2x3 and you pop one right here and the other, the other side, exactly where you placed the, kind of like the same place that you put the other one. If you'll let me, there we go, there we go, and then place an, one L, like so, and another like that. And that is how you do the underside of the Lapras model. Now, the moment that you've all been waiting for, you put the head on the head of the Lapras model onto the body. You gotta make sure that the uh, brown from the Lapras head is matching to the brown on the body. And that's it. Your lap the Lapras model is now complete and it's ready to transport any compatriots across the ocean of the Pokemon world. Alright guys, thank you very much for watching the video, I hope you enjoyed it. If you have, why not check out my latest video right here. If you haven't got anything to watch on the weekend or one of your days off, why not check out my playlist right here. And, if you aren't a subscriber to the channel, please do hit the subscribe button and you'll be notified on my latest videos. Hope to see you again soon, happy gaming, see you around.